I was just thinking about how last time I rode this bike um, got caught in the rain and how anyone under a certain age thinks if you ride rim brakes in the rain you'll fly off the road and explode in a blaze of flames. Um, that's actually not true. Even on cheap old center pole rim brakes you could still survive. You can live. You could ride them. They'll stop you. I'm even friction shifting. <laughs> What up? One of those days where it just got really nice and I should be working, but figured I just gotta go pedal for a couple miles, some chill ride. But it's Northeast Ohio, so the wind's making it, making it impossible just to have a chill ride, uh, like always. I should just be used to it and expect it. Ah, oh God, the wind is unbearable. I'm also doing a little bit of a shakedown ride on the Roger Rivieri. Haven't ridden it since the fall and it's what I'll be riding tomorrow on St. Patrick's Day. It was a friend's bike, a friend that's not around anymore. We just have a lot of history on that holiday so I always like to ride it on that day. What are you doing? I do have a whole video about the rider this bike is named after, Roger Rivieri, uh, my friend, and the current build, so I'll link that below if you're interested. Kind of some fun history in there, kind of a sad story on both cases though, so be prepared. <laughs> I did build this bike up as my original gravel bike, uh, uh, my first drop bar gravel bike. It's got 38s on it, and to me that was good enough, uh, and then I also used it as my touring bike for a number of years. Did the gap trail on it with Aaron. A couple multi-day trips with Ben, so. It seems every time I say this winter that this is the worst wind I've ever ridden in, uh, I gotta go and be proved wrong. Mother Nature's out for, for what I believe strong wind is apparently. But last night though with the group ride, it was in the low 30s. So I'll still take the wind in a little warmer, but it also is gonna keep this a short ride if you could even hear this. Well, I do enjoy St. Patrick's Day. I have to say, daylight savings time is my favorite holiday. Last night, even though it was cold, it was sunny. So the kickoff to our ride was really pretty out. It makes for cool looking footage. Uh, I love that late low sun for filming and but our wild ride of late winter spring weather, just every day completely different. gonna make a couple adjustments to the setup to make it a little more comfortable. It's amazing how uh, different the vintage road bikes feel when you don't ride them for a while, or just a road bike in general, but this being a cheap one, I always felt like it was kind of slack, but now that I almost always ride my gravel bike, it actually feels really twitchy in the front and it feels super long, so I'm gonna move the saddle as well. Someone is also going to ask me about this old pannier because every time I show it, it gets asked about. Erin used to have this uh, on her bike. This was her touring setup, but we got it from a friend. Uh, he got it from his neighbor. So road gear with an H. Uh, you would have to look them up on eBay. I've never found anything about them. An old made in the USA, like 70s style pannier touring bags. So yeah, Erin used to put these on her pacer and tour with those. So yeah, tilted the bars up a little bit. I got this long 3T stem and these Chinelli bars. They're probably worth more than everything else combined here. Oh yeah, what am I thinking? No saddle adjustment out here on the road. This is not gonna be an Allen wrench style. It's the old school style. Have to do that when I get home so it's ready for tomorrow. Let's hit the gravel.
top two stem shifters, baby. It really does only take a few miles to get used to the handling of a different bike for me. Um, I'm so used to the slackness of my gravel bike uh, and the quickness of this uh, steering is so different, but already used to that. It's just the position it has me in that's uncomfortable. So we'll finalize that when I get home. I'll do it for this one guys uh, just a 13 mile ride just to get out be in the warm weather feel some spring struggle with the wind uh, and get the Riviera set up uh, see you with the St. Patrick's Day video